Hi, my name is Chris. My name is Ferris. I'm Sam. I'm Lewis. And, and this, this is Zeal. Zeal is the number one place for the finest, healthiest drinks in Portsmouth. At Zeal, we aim to supply a range of drinks, snacks and supplements for your diet using quality ingredients that are locally sourced. According to a fruit juice, energy drink and juice drink market report conducted in 2015, evidence shows that the smoothie industry is forecast to boom. From this graph, you can clearly identify that from 2010 to 2015, the rise in market value has been consistent with a positive correlation. Regarding to the value proposition, we must take our stakeholders seriously in order to contribute towards our success. Due to the limited amount of healthy options in the high street, we believe that by integrating health and convenience, we'll be able to reach out to our customers. At Zeal, we want our customers to put their health first. We want them to feel good about themselves and we want them to feel satisfied. Of course, there'll be obstacles in our way which try and prevent us from achieving this. Since we're using high quality local fruit and vegetables, we prefer to enforce a premium pricing strategy so that we can cover all the costs and give customers the perception that our drinks are of quality. Due to limited resources, we may also be time consuming serving our customers because we have to thoroughly wash the blender after every use in case some customers have allergies to some of the ingredients. This can discourage a customer from buying products from us during rush hour. The high natural sugar content from the fruits can also discourage customers. This is why we're also offering vegetables in order to level out the ratios. There are also many gains from our service. All of the drinks will contain the amount of calories it contains as well as the macronutrients and the benefits that the drink will give you. This will motivate fitness enthusiasts to buy a drink. We would also have protein shakes in an attempt to bring gym enthusiasts to the store. Customers would expect a high consistency of quality and this is why we've obtained all of our ingredients locally. We will also give customers the chance to personalise their drinks either by adding more fruit or veg or by adding ingredients such as peanut butter. Customers will be able to judge whether we're successful or not by judging our price, quality, consistency and time efficiency. In order to achieve this, we'll be negotiating with our supplier in order to bring the prices down, inspect the food when we receive batches, give staff continuous on-the-job training and assign each member specific tasks so that we can get the job done as quick as possible. Due to the prices of our drinks, we'll also be giving students discount when they show us their student card. The startup costs for Zeal will be approximately £12,000, which will include our initial stock orders, our furniture and fittings, our equipment, and our first month's rent and deposit on our premises. Our startup capital will come from three sources personal savings, a bank loan, and our bank overdraft. Once the business is making a profit, money will be reinvested into the firm in order to increase business awareness and achieve growth. The relationship between us and our customers will be closely monitored in order to ensure we are providing our customers with the right products. We will allocate some of our resources to customer research, which will give us an improved understanding of our customer base and the feedback we receive from this research will provide us with ideas on how to improve our product range and increase our customer base. One of our most important relationships is our relationship with our employees. Wages will start at the national minimum wage of 6 70 an hour. However, as our business grows, we intend to increase this number. All full-time employees will be contracted to 40 hours a week with the opportunity to do overtime at an increased rate of pay. Part-time employees will be contracted to zero hours to allow flexibility in the days and hours they wish to work each week. Performance appraisals will be conducted at regular intervals in order to provide our employees with an opportunity to receive feedback from us and also to allow them to give us feedback on how we are doing as an employer. This will enable us to maintain a strong relationship with our employees and respond quickly to any issues that may arise. The market for juice bars in the UK is starting to take off, with the key competitors being Boost Juice Bars and Crush. However, in Portsmouth, the closest alternative to Zeal is Shakeaway, which sells milkshakes with high sugar and fat content. The university cafeterias sell smoothies, however the menu is limited and the location of these cafeterias is not convenient for anyone other than students. Being the first juice bar on Portsmouth's high streets will give us an opportunity to be the main competitor in Portsmouth and the lack of competition in the city will enable us to achieve growth at a rate that would not otherwise be possible. 
This lack of competition will also make it easier to create a high level of customer loyalty to our brand before any major competition enters the market. We estimate that we will generate a total of £131,000 of sales revenue in our first year of trading. After deducting our variable costs of £45,000, we will be left with a gross profit of £85,500. Deducting wages, rent, utilities, bank interest, insurance, asset depreciation and of course our generous marketing budget, we will be left with a net profit of £3,603. This will give us a return on capital employed of 30% in our first year. For our product requirement, we'll purchase raw materials like fruits and veg, plastic cups, protein shakes and snacks um, from suppliers like Market Fresh and Produce. Um, we'll also be buying machineries like fridges, ice crushers and blenders. Um, the industrial ones are more recommended for us. Um, the employees will be myself, Chris, Sam and Lewin. Timing for this business is crucial as, for example, when students from university go to their classes, they perhaps finish at 12.30. Therefore, we would be prepared to put a stand and offer our services to them, which shows good customer care and so forth. Zill has carried out some research and we have found a brilliant property near Commercial Road and we found that it is a prime location for our business. In order to promote our business, we are going to give out free samples of our products and get a feedback from them. In order to attract students, we will offer student discounts on our products as well. Um, we were planning to advertise our business by word of mouth, leaflet, banners and create a website. Handing out free samples will also increase our brand recognition, which then increases our intangible asset. We have carried out research on the competition and used this as the basis for our prices. As you can see here, our price for a small drink is £2 and £2.50 with a snack. Our price for a medium is £3 and £3.50 with a snack, and for a large is £4 and £4.50 with a snack. We feel these prices are consistent with our value proposition, but may be subject to change over time. Now we'll be discussing procurement and supply. Uh, this involves obtaining the goods and services that will enable the organisation to operate. Uh, this includes purchasing the equipment, such as the fridges and blenders, and also the raw materials, for example, the fruits and vegetables, for our key supplies. For the initial equipment, we'll use a range of retailers that offer the best value. We will use Carrows as our main supply for the fridges and freezers. We will use uh, Cash Tools Direct to purchase our cash register, as they offer specific models for coffee and juice bars. Uh, finally, we will obtain our blender from Vitamix, as they offer industry-leading blenders used by other companies such as Starbucks and Costa. Uh, now, because our business deals with perishable goods, uh, being the fruit and vegetables used for our drinks, uh, we've decided to partner up with local fruit and veg suppliers so that goods spend less time in transit and therefore be fresher for our juices, uh, providing customers with a high quality product. Uh, these key suppliers are Market Fresh Hampshire and Produce UK based in the South East. Uh, Market Fresh will supply us with a high quality fruit and vegetables in large quantities at a respectable price. For example, we can obtain 60 apples at a price of £15. Uh, they also source locally and therefore contribute a reduced carbon footprint reflecting well on our business and our sustainability goals. Our other key supplier is Produce, whom we will obtain our frozen fruit selection from, and also our cups. It is possible to purchase 10 kilograms of frozen apples for an exceptional price of £17.50, and 200 uh, large plastic cups for £15. Both of these suppliers are able to deliver frequently throughout the week, uh, so there's always a uh, backup if we were to run out of supply during commerce. We expect to be receiving deliveries Monday morning to start off the week with fresh produce and the midpoint of the week so that we have a constant supply of fresh fruits to use as our ingredients. Due to the current market situation and our expected sales revenue, we believe that Zeal will prove to be a viable business venture and a sound investment. Thank you for listening.